This week, in conjunction with the Make-A-Wish Foundation and with the support of Disney, ESPN is turning sports wishes into reality for five kids battling serious illness as part of our My Wish series. One boy from Georgia wanted to try his video game skills against a Super Bowl winning quarterback. Turns out that wasn't the only place where he got to score points against some of the NFL's best. Chris Conley has the story. Fourteen-year-old Akeem Havens calls this his go-kart, a dune buggy in which his father drives him around near their home in Flowery Branch, Georgia, where he grew up as a sturdy, athletic child. He was throwing the football with my husband, and it's like when I seen him throw that ball, it's like a perfect spiral. I said, oh, he's going to be a quarterback one day. But then, of course, things changed. They changed on July 5th, 2001 on the way back from nearby Stone Mountain after a day of climbing and an evening of fireworks. It's not a day that goes by that I don't think about it because that was the best day that we ever had together as a family. And for it to end the way it did, it was just hard. Akeem got a ride home with relatives. As they neared an intersection, an ambulance swerved into oncoming traffic. Cars collided at high speed. At the hospital, his parents received grim news. Seven-year-old Akeem was paralyzed from the neck down. They told us his neck was broke and his spinal cord was torn but not severed. And it was touch and go at that time. That's devastation to any father knowing that he was in another car with somebody else and the fact that he wasn't going to walk again. And so, for the last seven years, Akeem must depend on his family to change his clothes, to move him from his bed to his wheelchair, to feed him. He handles it better than we do. like a normal 14 year old kid most people me I'd be mad 24 7 he just goes on that's what he can with what he's got thanks to a chin operated controller his father built for him Akeem can play video games for his wish Akeem wants to play against his favorite football player, Ben Roethlisberger of the Pittsburgh Steelers. That would just be one of the best days of my life. A 14-year-old kid beating a Super Bowl winning quarterback at video games. That would be one to go in the history books. Akeem, his parents, and his younger brother, James, set out for the 12-hour drive from Flowery Branch that brings them to Pittsburgh and eventually to a tour of Heinz Field. Once there, Akeem is shocked to see a message for him on the Jumbotron. Akeem. 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 Or should I say rookie? Hey, listen, I hope you enjoyed your tour of Heinz Field where I get it done on Sundays, but listen, the tour is over. Report to practice tomorrow, and you better bring your A game, because we're not messing around anymore. Starting tomorrow, you're a rookie, day one. That I didn't expect. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tomorrow, no. day one, rookie. <laughs> <laughs> More surprises are in store the next day at the Steelers' training facility, where Akeem gets a look at the team's five Super Bowl trophies. Come on in here, Akeem. Like any high-profile Steelers rookie, He's greeted by owner Dan Rooney. How are you, Akeem? Nice to see you. Without an agent, Akeem gets signed to a contract. And right now, we're very pleased to announce the newest Pittsburgh Steeler, Akeem Havens. Next, Akeem gets a jersey. Hey, what's going on in here? 
Hey, we don't have time for this. We got practice. <laughs> we, what, what are you doing? We got to get to practice. You want to go to practice? We don't have time for all this media stuff. We got to go. <laughs> now, you left your playbook in the mirror. You know what that means, right? That's big trouble. Kim, how you doing, bud? Doing pretty good. Doing good? Are you ready to go to practice? Let's go to practice. All right, let's go to practice. All right, so this is locker room. Now, don't tell anybody what you're seeing here. This is, this is, this is sacred in here, okay? Akeem gives Ben a photo that he posts up in his locker. See, you're my only team I actually hang up, so I'll go right here. That'll be there. Oh, you come back and check us out later in the year, that'll still be there. Before practice, the two get to know each other a little. Yeah. Do all these cameras bother you? No? <laughs> you're just like, whatever, right? <laughs> you got get used to it? What's the point of wearing? There you go. I like that attitude. Lots of other Steelers stop by and say hello to Akeem. What's up, man? <laughs> you all right? Doing pretty good today. You doing good? You gonna hit somebody today? <laughs> Don't hit me. Make sure it ain't me. Please. Akeem, <laughs> right. what's up, bro? Not much. Welcome to the Steelers. Before taking the field, head coach Mike Tomlin introduces Akeem to his new team. Hey, guys. Got a great work day today. We got a new sign here, we got a new stealer, man. Everybody say hello, and let's welcome Akeem and his family. Yeah. Akeem takes in this Steelers practice right from the sideline, but then he's invited onto the field to run a play against the tough Steelers D. High right, 25 Bob on one, right? Say Ben hands off the ball to Akeem. And then the boy who used to throw spirals becomes the teenager who can't be stopped until he's in the end zone. Your first NFL touchdown, you get to keep the game ball. All right? Good job, bud. Team on three. One, two, three. Team! Good job. Good job. Hey, you're still a rookie, so take that helmet off. Get out of here. You're still a rookie, take that in, folks. It's already been an amazing day. But after lunch, Akeem gets his wish. Go one-on-one -on -one in a video game against Big Ben. He's going to beat me so fast. And you guys know it. You guys are going to let this happen. As Ben settles in with Akeem, he realizes he's in trouble. I don't know any moves. <laughs> and gets beaten. Dang it. Dang it. I know, I know what to do now, though. You lost. Ben signs a jersey for Akeem. You know you're the man. All right? That'll work for you. And they pose one final time, the ideal ending to a picture-perfect day. As for the future, Akeem hopes to go to college someday and study video game design, of course. You can learn more about Akeem and his wish at ESPN.com.